Hey YouTube, this is Calvary Camper coming to you with another video. I know it's been a while, I've been working my butt off. It's a busy, busy season, even though they got this pandemic going on. It don't stop people from my job, so I just want to give you guys an update here. This is my uh, my more Garberg. I bought this multi-mount sheath for the uh, the console originally. I just bought it like this and then I wanted the, the multi-mount sheath afterwards so that's what I got then I did the same thing with the Garberg I just bought the uh, the regular poly sheath model and then I thought I'd try this out with the, the multi-mount and I just switched over the uh, fire steel and stuff that I had on the console onto here but anyways there's looks good and all in black But the one thing I wanted to show was I put this belt loop on there. It does not normally have one. So the console, or the, yeah, on the console here, you see it's got the belt loop here. This is the standard one that comes with the poly sheath, which is just this little piece here. So. You know, that snaps onto the poly sheath, and there's that little strap there. The same strap here, I just cut it off, and then uh, put it through that one single hole there. It's the same piece, I just flipped it around so you can... I just didn't want the screw to pull through. So yeah, I just cut it off the, the original uh, sheath mount whatever you want to call this thing, belt loop mount. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah, so the only thing I did was just put that screw through there with the with the bolt and there's the back side of it. I already had a hole there, like um like this one here, same thing. Same, same thing there that was up here. I guess you could move this up or down if you wanted. But yeah, I just thought it was cool. It'd be cool if this came like this in, in the first place. You can have even more mounting options if you want to have a belt loop, you know, the dangler style, or or having that multi mount you can mount to your pack or whatever. So yeah, there's that. Just the update on the the more guard bird. And I was thinking about uh, the scripture and just the only thing that came to my mind right away was in the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. It's just a thing that we got to hold on to. Just know that the Lord was there from the beginning from day one. And there's nothing too big for him or too small. So when we dig into all this survival stuff and learning and stuff, we got to remember, you know, who's the one who gave us that mind to learn and to to survive in the first place and all the the uses and resources we have out in there for us and for us to use we can give thanks to the Lord for. So that's it. I just wanted to do a short little video. There's a multi mount sheath. This is I did another video on this already with the console so if you want to see that just you know fire steel, little pen cap, ranger bands. Um, you know, a hair tie piece so you can just secure it onto the sheath itself and that's about it and I carry that uh, sharpening stone here and this has a ranger band around it as well and just sets in there and then that polish sheath holds it in place you know after you strap it all down and stuff so yeah it's not a Super fancy, but I'm gonna move it back a hair more. But anyway, there it is. Just moved it all over from the console to the guard bird. Still love the console, but that uh, the guard bird's a new baby now. So I'm planning on doing a video with the guard bird and the the more robust. If uh, things work out okay there's a robust there 
And um, yeah, they're from the actual use of them. I mean, I know the handle's different, obviously, but the blade feels very similar. So I don't know, maybe if you can't afford a, a Garber, just a uh, Robust would be an option for whatever this was, 14, 15 bucks. But yeah, no, might have a little bit of time to do some videos, so hopefully I can get that done. Just wanted to say thank you guys, and sorry I haven't posted in a while. Just hope that you guys will stay blessed. Um, remember to keep your eyes on the prize, it's Jesus Christ and Him crucified. So. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.